Hey everyone, and welcome back to Stellaris as the Roman Star Empire. We have another peace treaty between the Rathelian Interplanetary Commonwealth and the Great Hithian Empire. So it's basically, uh, I believe, Yondarim Hithi and the Hithian Empire fighting the Nagyari as well as the Inter... Yeah, the Interplanetary Commonwealth. These two are allied against these two, and these two seem to be the stronger ones. Um, so that's interesting. Now, we obviously just have to recover from our over or our attack from these raiders. Um, but I think that is okay. I have a, I have a plan now on how we do things. Uh, once we have these fortresses built here, here, and here, and they're really upgraded, we should be fine, uh, at least from the, you know, from the south. We do have this to guard the wormhole, but we have actually pretty nice people there. Um, so I don't even think they're going to attack us. Um, and yeah, so I think overall we're actually in pretty good shape. Uh, I do obviously need to upgrade a lot of things here. And we need to make sure that there's no places for pirates to attack us. Um, but that, that we Recon will do. Pass completed. Uh, systems have been surveyed. That's fine. Yeah, our economy is looking pretty good right now. We Aliens have signed a federal cooperation treaty. Federation Invitation. The great Decathan autocracy and the nation of Vitisrius Prime joined a glorious entente. So that is these guys as well as where is Vitisrius Prime? Oh, these, right. Ah, these are these guys. I see. Yeah. Interesting. You are Federation Builders, obviously. We can ask for association status. Um, don't know what that means. But that means we have no non-aggression pact with them anymore. We cannot ask to join the Federation because they don't want us. Interesting. Clans of Emery's Emerald are their vassals. That's a pretty powerful block. And I think, you know what, this could help us. Because I don't think that they particularly uh yeah i don't think you like the aryan avarian allied worlds and who do you have as enemies only the ravagers yeah this is more in a coalition against the ravagers and not against the whole Xarian empire so okay that's interesting can we check this diplomatic worlds uh, map mode what about this ai He's friendly towards them. Diplomacy. And the Federation. Okay. Has Migration Pact. Do I have any friends? I have Non-Aggression Pact with these three to the north. So, yeah, to the north we're actually pretty well protected. It's just the south that's been uh, frustrating. Oh, well. Yeah, that's just the way it is. Um, this peace offer we've seen. And Holy Xarian Empire was given association status by the Glorious Entente. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, this sucks. This sucks big time. Well, we have to just build up. Complete. It, it doesn't, you know, there's no way around it. We have to build up. Build the mining stations here. Build up our economy. Just make us ourselves strong enough. Kantari Sankrasek was given association status, which we could get as well. But I'm not interested, honestly. Not if they... Give it to the Xarians. But yeah. So, many things we can do. We have this shipyard division reports that is a new breakthrough. doing things. The Glorious Entente does not only cooperate with its members. We would like to extend an offer of association. I don't know what that means, but I think association is basically just a non-aggression pact. Um... Uh, we can add... Okay, if the Roman interest in attaining association status. We can ask them for association status. We'll increase their trust. Uh, I mean, I just said no. But honestly, it's probably not that bad. Because it's sort of like a non-aggression pact with them. We will accept this. Because they control the wormhole to our lands. And... Yeah. We're not going to join the Federation. But... Maybe being associated with them. At least say we're on good terms. I mean, we had a non-aggression pact with them before. So I don't see why this should be an issue necessarily. Now, 
we uh, we can now build new hydroponics farms. We can go for gene modification, robot resource production. That sounds good. Or growth speed, assault armies, combat training. Maybe a little bit of combat training. Let's do some, do some combat training there. Yeah. All right, moving on. Still want to go for that scientific leap, but currently we are having a few issues. Oh my goodness, we can upgrade everything. Yeah, food. All right, well... Okay, we got to do this. Let's upgrade Earth here. I don't think the food is necessary. We can upgrade this to Biolab 2. Biolab 2. And that's it for now. Let's upgrade Earth. Because that's giving us a lot of good stuff. For now. Construction Damn. complete. We don't have enough of anything. Yeah, what are we going to do here? Uh, this system or this one? I think this one is better. Move here. Claim it for us. Construction complete. And what was done? I think that was just a ship being built. Mm -hmm. Kingdom Yondarim. Okay, everyone has kind of association status with that federation, uh, interestingly enough. I suppose that makes sense. Actually, you know what? You, I want you to move here and build up that stuff. This guy can build it here in the in the northern part. I'm going to call it the north. You know what I mean, obviously. Uh, pirates again. Again here. Come on, that's bullshit. It's not like they can destroy anything, but... I mean, actually, they can. Ah, uh, this sucks. This really sucks. Reinforce the fleet. I'm not going to send my entire fleet to kill pirates. Um, at least I don't feel like doing that. Let's send... Let's send... Maybe... One... Two... Three... Four destroyers. Two, three, four, five... Six, seven, eight Corvettes. Um, yeah. And we'll send the classes two here. I hope that's sufficient. System reconnaissance completed. Might not be. It probably isn't, actually. Now I think about it. Freaking pirates, man. Skywatch is tracking a new enemy fleet. Yeah, it's not sufficient. Oh, goodness. Fine. Bring out the fleet. We'll go here. God damn it. Bring the entire freaking fleet over here to deal with these stupid pirates. Yeah, this is a bug, but I'm not playing the uh, beta patch because I don't see why. Okay, you have all kinds of things happening. Yeah, they're going to destroy are engaging in more of our things. I mean, this would not really be an issue if we had Starbase here. Which I meant to build. Anyway. Which we're going to do soon. Great Decathentocracy declared war on the Ravagers. Interesting. And everyone is... Basically, this is a federation against the Ravagers here. Because these fanatic purifies are quite powerful, it seems. But oh well. <sighs> yep, my navy's coming. And another encounter... Mem aliens. Well, let's find out who that is. I thought for sure we had met everyone yet. But I guess we'll find someone else. It's probably... I mean, it could Special be here. Project complete. Oh, it's space amoebas. Fine. Let's study them. Uh, we, I've read this. I'm not reading this out right now because I had this event several times. So, yeah, I just felt like we can skip it. Anti-matter reactor. Advanced shields. Yeah, let's go with that. Advanced shields could help us in the long run. But, I mean, System with all of our fleet out, we're completed. still making some significant, uh, yeah, minerals. So that's good. Ooh. Space Immobiles forever. 
Mm, the name is stuck, it's pronounced C. Yeah, okay. Fascinating. What do we get? Cosmic Ray cat Catalysis. Energy credits plus five. Oh, really? Until the end? Oh, that's very nice. Extra energy credits. I love that. Now I feel like I should have read it out. Just because. But yeah. You two should merge and move and destroy whatever is over there. Okay. This starbase needs to be upgraded. No, but what also needs to happen is this needs to be upgraded. To a start port. And as does this. Start ports. Yeah. So those are the three we have. They need to be upgraded stronger. And then we'll probably need something in the north as well. I'm thinking about having one here. But this is actually not all that useful. Mm, probably have some here. Alert con one in effect. Enemy offensive oh, action imminent. Oh shit. This is not a drill. Declaration of war. This is declaration of war. Your vile ethos can no longer be tolerated. Wow. Freaking Holy Xarian Empire declaring a war on the Romans. Yeah, okay. Um, we're in our first war. They are superior. Their fleet power is equivalent, but they have higher naval capacity. Yeah. That's unfortunate because we're not yet ready. I think. Well, actually, you know what? Our fleet is on its way down here. Okay. Fine. I think we'll have a fleet set the... Mm. We'll have a fleet move here and then here. Quickly going into their space. That's fine. I mean, they could attack us from all over the place, right? So it's important that we build up our bases here. And Janna... Yeah, you need to be upgraded especially. I'm going to go with a gun battery. And I'm going to go with a hangar. And as for buildings, I also want to have crew quarters. Just so that we can have ships docked here and they don't cost as much. And then the fences. You don't have the resources for a defensive platform. But this needs to be defended. Yeah, a planet here. Anything we can build on the planet? You know, tons of things. Yeah, but we're kind of lacking the resources right now to do all these things. Um, this is going to be a defensive war on my part. I don't mean to to destroy anything. I, I just kind of want to live for now. And hopefully that works. Construction I mean, luckily complete. the Fallen Empire should be blocking any movement. So it's really one, two entrances they have and then obviously this one uh, but all of these systems are already raided so it's not like they can really destroy much there anymore uh and there is the pirate fleet yep well you'll be destroyed enjoy we'll actually move in here first and a construction ship has nothing to do that's always bad now give me yeah, you can, you can repair this. That's fine. Give me this system. Because it's such a good one. Yeah, I want it. System reconnaissance completed. Okay, SPQ Astrabo cancels auto exploration. It cannot reach or find any unsurveyed systems. Alright. Oh, and there's another tropical world. Good. In that case, I want you to assist research. Where do we have a lot of research anyways? On Earth? Um, we have one, two, three, four, five. We have Terra Nova. We have one, two, three, four. Sirius Prime. One, two, three, four. Okay, you know what? Let's just go here and assist research. Wait, what? Can can you not 
What are you doing? Can you not move home? What's your problem? Why can you not move to this system? Ah, you cannot move here because there's life tree protectors. The Fallen Empire doesn't give us axes. Ah, we need basically open borders from you guys. Hmm. I wonder if that... Yes, that gives us open borders again. And then... You should be able to automatically explore again. Alright, perfect. I think that was just the only issue. Yeah, cancel that, but yeah, you can do it again. Alright, so here we're gonna freaking attack whatever they have. We should destroy it easily. Hopefully not taking any damage. Alright, perfect. Getting a f little bit for it, but not much. And let's make our way here. Now, most likely, we will not see any conflict here. Because I think the Xarians are busy with other things. Or rather, uh, the Xarians, they will... I don't know. I don't think they're really gonna do much to us. There is a hostile fleet. We could destroy the construction ship here. But yeah... Here's the thing, like, because the Marauders went through here, most of this is actually destroyed. Like, um, it doesn't really make much sense to have a war right now, but it's okay. I mean, we're gonna have our fleet parked here. We'll build up our defenses. Um, you are building up your defenses, right? Yeah, upgrading this to starports. We'll build all kinds of other cool things. Um, Recon pass completed. And, uh, in fact, I'm... Upgrading you to a star hold here just to make you extra strong. Construction complete. Okay. Yeah, we have a few bases here and they will be upgraded um, whenever we can. We have you here. Please build research and mining stations. And we build up to here and then anything that's here we'll just not, you know, really care about for now because it's, it's going to be raided anyways. It's basically uh, terrain that we can't protect at the moment. But as long as we have this in place, no enemy fleets can simply enter our territory, which is great. Unless they can somehow jump across hyperlanes, but I don't think that's possible. At least not yet. I know it's possible, actually, but it's not yet possible. Or shouldn't be for anyone. Okay, so you're just chilling there. Fleet. And there is a fleet coming. 9,000 strength and an actual assault army. And it looks like they're coming. Are they coming where I think they're coming? For? Yep. They're coming for us here. Now that is bold. And I think stupid as well. And this might be the chance for us to destroy them. They are... They're coming right for the Manwood system where we actually have a thing. That's cool. Yep, they're actually coming. Holy shit. Alright, let's turn this off. And, um... Cool. We have modules here. We have a hangar bay and we have gun batteries. And we do have a few defense platforms here as well. Let me check this out, how this goes. You should now not be able to go anywhere else. 10,000 strength. Alright. They're now going to engage one of our stations. Um, what's happening here? Is this a strike craft? Yeah, this is a little strike craft that is detaching from the hangar here. Look at this. Coming out of here. Oh no, actually somewhere else. Alright, so. Battle has begun. 
We have... With the base, we have more power. But our fleet itself is not strong enough to defeat them. And they do have their transports as well. 9,600. Oh my goodness. It looks like they're destroying us re relatively quickly. 6,300 against 8,000. Our base is... Our base is not really as helpful as I thought it would be. Hmm. We have a shield here, our destroyer still doing pretty well. I mean, our base is actually quite helpful, I, I gotta admit. It's soaking up a lot of damage. 4,000 against 6,000. Oh, yes! We might be able to do this, actually. I think we're beating the Mac. This. Uh, thing here was not a failure, it seems. 3,000 against 5,000. Hmm. And their transport is just kind of laying back. But yeah, we're weakening them enough, I think, so that our trans... Uh, our thing here might be able to hold them off, whatever they have left. But that might just be wrong. They have a lot of heavy cruisers here. Where we have basically... Corvettes mostly. With little fighters as well. Oh my god, this is actually really cool. Can't say if we're winning or we're not. I would say we're losing. It's hard to say. Maybe we can kill one of these cruisers here. They have so many cruisers. Seven, apparently. With a lot more Corvettes. The base is being attacked. I mean, if this falls... It at least did its its duty, I would say. 1,800 strength against 2,000. And then we still have this. Oh, but this is on a heavy fire from these destroyers. Is this still just the defense platform that's being destroyed? Or is this actually the, the thing already? Can't really say. But yeah, look at this. We have... We still have a little bit of armor left. And... Uh, shields. And more hull. We won! We fucking won. Damn it, we won. And we only won because of the station and because they flew in this station. Holy shit, look at this. 92 relative war exhaustion. Other defeat. Wait, what? Our war exhaustion plus 80%. What? Other defeat? We won. What are you talking about? We lost one defense platform. What? What? They only lost two Corvettes. We lost a cruiser, 12 destroys, and 6 Corvettes. And you're telling me they only lost two Corvettes? That cannot be true. High war exhaustion. Um, that doesn't make sense. The war exhaustion passively accumulated during this war. Uh, I thought we won. Hmm, I guess they just retreated or something? Probably. Um... Yeah, okay, well, I guess we'll repair our fleet. Returning to Manwood Station. And that means, yeah, we lost a lot of ships. We need to build up. Let's immediately do that. And build four destroyers. Five, even. Yeah, okay. Um, that is interesting. The first large space battle we had. I think we did pretty well, but apparently we didn't. How did we only kill two Corvettes? It makes no sense. It makes no sense. I, I, don't, I don't understand. I thought for sure we killed a lot more. I mean, they brought ten cruisers. Um, what? I'm a little bit confused um, about how this went, honestly. Um, but, I mean, they don't control any of our systems, so I think it's fine. We stopped their invasion. They're likely going to come again, 
But for now, I think we did pretty well. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm going to have to end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you next time.